how to use a singing bowl to release shoulder tension and neck pain. So shoulder tension and neck pain uh, commonly find nowadays in many people. So if you have a singing bowl at home, you have you can use it wisely to help to reduce this problem. Before we use the singing bowl, we need to release the fascia onto the neck area and the shoulder area. So divide your shoulder and the neck onto the left side and the right side. So I'm going to show you one side first. So release the muscle on the left side of your shoulder. So put your fingers here, four fingers right on the front part of the neck and then the thumb right at the side of the shoulder. So just going into a circular motion, releasing the muscle here. Mm. For the muscle so you can go in to a circular motion so the fascia can be released by going in to circular motion in this way make sure you're not pressing on her bone it's more on to the muscle so you can do it two to three minutes here at the same spot So after a gentle release on the fascia, you can now we move down to the shoulder. So this is our shoulder blade. So what we need to release is the rhomboid muscle right underneath the shoulder blade. So you need to fold her arm this way and relax. So what you really do here is using your finger, find, find the muscle just next to her shoulder blade not at the bone here not at the blade here but just inside some somewhere underneath yeah so just also same thing going into a circular motion Shoulder blade, remember moving the circle motion so that the fascia can be softened and released. Relax. Okay. Okay, so use a cloth, cover her shoulder so that the bow can move easily. So same thing now, you divide your uh, body into three parts, the center part, the neck, the spine, and then you have the left shoulders and the right shoulders. So where you put the ball, put right here, <coughs> below the neck, right? So in between the shoulder blade. So same thing, use your finger, press on the base of the ball and keep the side. more rounds on the same spot then now move over to the left side close to her shoulder blade the top part of the shoulder blade same thing so you can move the ball around like creating some massage to her shoulder blade slightly forward, close to her neck but not touching her ear. Be gentle here because this is really close to her ear. Now come to the lower part of the shoulder blade.
the middle somewhere close to the heart chakra shoulder remember repeat as many times as you like really close to her ear and then the final one come right at her neck gently placing the ball now this one hit the ball gently not too loud not too hard you find the sounds are down repeat And it's so simple, I'm sure you can do it at home.